do, that'd be awesome. Dragging off, really? What up guys, it's Darren, I'm back, and today I'm bringing you a little bit of Capture the Flag with the MP5K Rapid Fire on Jungle. And, um, this is actually my first gun in my new series called, uh, actually this is the first episode of my new series called, uh, called, uh, I guess it's called, uh. Okay guys, this is my series called, uh. No, this is my series called, why can I not think? It's the problem with doing commentaries. Every time I get on the microphone, I can't think. I'm a freaking idiot. We have the enemy flag. Yeah, it's called Weapons of Choice. Because I had to pause the commentary just to freaking think. It's whatever. But, uh, so Weapons of Choice is pretty much where me or you guys let me know about, uh, really good guns. And,. It's not just good guns, you know, like the four main overpowered weapons. I'm pretty sure you know what they are. This Stoner, 74U, FAMAS, and AUG are the main overpowered weapons in the game. But pretty much this is to find alternates. You know, to spice the game up a little bit, have a lot of fun. And pretty much the first one is the MP5K with the rapid fire. I was actually really surprised when I found out how good this gun is. It's a beast. Trust me. It can easily outgun the FAMAS or the AUG. Even the stoner. I even kill a guy using a stoner in this game. But the best part about it is you get it at a very low rank. In fact, you start off with it. Except it doesn't have rapid fire. But when you make a class, you can just slap rapid fire on it when you get 3,000 COD points. And you can just pretty much get to work. Um, surprisingly enough, you can spray with it. As you'll see me do a lot. And still do surprisingly well. Look at this, I go to shoot the claim and the guy just comes running. I missed my last shot and shoot the claim. And it, it, this is a really good run and gun run and gun weapon that I would definitely recommend for capture the flag. You know, so you don't just have to be limited to the AK-74U if you want to do well. I mean, I'm, I'm being completely honest, I'm surprised at just how good this gun is. I've actually used it and I'm like level 20 something. I'm still using it. It's amazing. So, pretty much what the series is going to be is I've already told you, but uh, I just want you guys to comment right now on any guns that you've used that are surprisingly well, you know, better than you would think. And come on, MP5K with rapid fire? What the hell? But there are exceptions to the MP5K with rapid fire. Exception number one is it runs out of ammo very quickly and it runs out of a clip very quickly. So to counteract both of those, I would definitely, definitely recommend using Sleight of Hand and Scavenger on the same class. This way, uh, you can reload faster and get your ammo back faster because there's no dual mag on the MP5K for whatever reason. And there is an extended mag, but you can't use the extended mag with rapid fire, which is kind of retarded in my opinion. And so since you have your sleight of hand, you reload faster, you have your scavenger, you have more ammo altogether, and I didn't really see that guy, but I saw, I did see him, but I didn't really get it, was able to, I just saw a glimpse of him, so I wasn't really actually able to pinpoint his location and shoot him, gun him down. And I think I'm using as my secondary the ballistic knife just for SNGs, shits and giggles. But I didn't really think I was going to use this gameplay for my uh, weapons of choice. You know, it, it works. I only get one death, I do believe. And it's capture the flag, and you don't really see that many capture the flags. Because I find I mosey my way over here into their spawn, get a quick kill, and I actually kill the guy who has a flag. Teammate grabs a flag and he hauls ass over there to capture it. Place down my jammer and I get ready to capture their flag. Get their flag and get the hell out of there. So yeah guys, make sure you leave a comment on what gun you want me to use. And make sure it's not something that's going to screw me over, because if it's not exceptionally well, if it's not exceptionally a good gun, then probably isn't going to be one of your weapons of choice. So just keep that in mind, you know, 
No stoner, no AK-74U, no AUG, and no FAMAS. Any other gun will be fine. And if you guys are prestigion, I would definitely recommend using the MP5K with rapid fire. I personally like it with ice camo, which just looks pretty badass. And that's one thing that they should have done. They should have def... said definitely way too much. They should have given us more camos. I mean, the camos in this game are really lame. Just saying. I think this is the game winning cap. Game winning flag. I, I didn't really know that guy was going to be there. I just had a feeling that he, someone was going to chase me. But that guy, he shot at me and almost killed me, actually. Well, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this first episode of Weapons of Choice. I didn't really have much to talk about the MP5K because I've been using it for a while now. And it's a good gun. You can spray with it, spray and pray. You can close range. It kills people almost instantly, which is nice. So uh, feel free to give it a try. Let me know what camo it looks the sexiest in, in your opinion. And I'll see you in the next episode. And I know I said it three times already, but make sure you comment below on what your weapon of choice is, and I might just check it out. In fact, I'll probably be more inclined to check it out if you actually comment about it. So. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace. We captured the enemy flag. Mission accomplished. Evac on the way. Yes. Fuck you, Charlie.